ceiling to floor, wall to wall, and yes, even from the showers to the toilets. The home of Stony Kerr showcases well over 43 years of collections in Cowboys memorabilia. Hello, I'm Stony Kirsch, curator of the Dallas Cowboy Museum. Y'all come on in and check it out. First thing on the agenda would be Emmett. Named it Emmett because it's quick and fast and has the moves just like he did. This here is Mel. I named it Mel because he was the first player to ever come and see the museum. Step on over here, come on to the field. Hand painted to scale, replica of the field up there at uh, AT&T. Complete with the ring of honor above it. Let me introduce y'all to Dak. New little Christmas present this season. Items line every inch of this 1300 square foot home, ranging from the eras of the Cowboys early beginnings to modern day. Y'all come on in the house here. Since he was four years old, Kirsch, now 48, has made it his life's pursuit for the rare and specialized in Cowboys memorabilia. There's one, uh, one room, I call it the bobblehead room. You got the Dallas Cowboy bobbleheads in this case here. Ask them if we're going to the Super Bowl this year. And they all say yes. Over here you got Bob Lilly, some bunch of items from the 60s at the Cotton Bowl days. Here's some choppers, Dallas Cowboy choppers, some uh, pieces of turf, airplanes, electric football games, posters. You run out of wall space, so you got to have one of these and put your posters in. Lighters, you name it. If it's Cowboys, it's here. The home is estimated to contain hundreds of thousands of items, costing, well, not even Kirsch knows that answer. Venture to guess how much this stuff's worth. I mean, that would take me a long time to sit down and figure all that out. I really don't know. You know, I, I'm not in it to sell anything. Or, and it's not about how much you collect or how much stuff you got. That's not what it's about. I, I, mine just happened to turn into that. And I have a wonderful wife that lets me do this, that lets me collect these things and put them in our bedroom and in our living room and all that. And, but it's, it, it's not about how many pieces you got. It's just about loving the Dallas Cowboys, America's team and being there to root them on to victory, you know, because they couldn't win without the fans, you know. They, they wouldn't play the game if it wasn't for the fans. To Kirsch, there is no amount of money that could replace his collection. That's why he won't sell any of it, because to him, it truly is priceless. So I could almost remember where I got all this, you know, this, every piece I can pretty much know if I got it for Christmas or who gave it to me or where I found it at, whether it be a flea market or garage sale or just on the internet or anywhere. These are the these are the buttons uh, all, dating all the way back to the Cotton Bowl days that they used to you know for uh, souvenirs you know at the Cotton Bowl, and then you got to throw this in Ezekiel Elliott color splash jersey, hard to find. And then in here in the kitchen area, you got uh, some some Emmett stuff. You know he is NFL's all-time leading rusher, so you got to have a wall of Emmett. And you got to have the Dallas Cowboy gumball machine, mugs, every mug you can think of, action figures. Um, every can or bottle that the Cowboys have ever been on, every cup. And then over here you got the four-wheel drive monster truck Dallas Cowboys. Pretty fast, it goes about 65 miles an hour. And then uh, you got all their old decks of playing cards, neon signs, uh, electric guitars Dallas Cowboys, every calendar that they've ever been on. There's the Cowboy kites, Cowboy umbrellas from uh, Super Bowl 12. Got cars in here, salt and pepper shakers, decanters, you name it, it's, there's all kinds of stuff here. Kirsch and his wife Diana welcomed any and all visitors to see this spectacular collection. I'll lower this down for you so you can see my idea of a Dallas Cowboy City. Coming down in three, two, one. Donations are accepted but not required to enjoy this truly unique Cowboys attraction. For DallasCowboys.com, I'm Lindsey Draper.